Hey guys, my ex is here. I'm sorry. Bullet tongue bottle. I'm sorry, last time I showed a very shameful side. I got everything, almost everything correct, but I failed at the last game. かにもしゃばるぬドアノブからネジを外す際その部屋にあったものを使わなかったその代わりに彼が使ったのはおそらく彼自身のものだったはずだ。ファイトデビット。ファイトデビット。ファイトデビット。ファイトデビット。ファイ
during the bullet time battle you want to destroy your opponent's statements in time with the rhythm. Match your button presses with each temple marker as they move across the No! Wait! It's a move across the screen! Oh god! Press the right mouse button to lock onto an opponent's statement. Destroy this main statement you have locked onto which the left mouse the temple maker reach the center. Okay. This is the method to deal damage to rub. If you can't pull it off, you will be the one in pain. Do this consecutively and you'll start the combo. Keep this going and you'll initiate the tempo up. The flip side, if you keep missing, you'll get a tempo down situation. When the tempo changes, so that's the time for each hitting button. So watch out for that. Do not damage to your opponent until we discuss them and will appear. Point and press the left mouse button to shoot the down with triple. Okay. That part that that last part I I understand. But <laughs> about reloading and locking locking statements. Getting this far and not being able to defeat me. サワールームのドアノブは。ネジが外されてたけどさ。犯人はそのネジを外すって言ったら。ドライバーだろ。だったら配られた工具セットの中にあったべ。あれを使ったんでしょうな。他に工具などありませんでしたし。だけど僕の
お前らお手元のスイッチで投票してくださいあ念のために言っとくけど必ず誰かに投票するようにしてくださいねこんなつまらないことで罰を受けたくないでしょはいでは張り切ってまいりますよ投票の結果プロとなるのは誰かさあどうなんでしょう He has Celeste's hair. That's so funny. Okay, moving on. The one thing that was more important to her than anything else her dreams, her friends. To have to see something like that happen to them. And Sayaka. I did whatever it took to reach that dream. I mean it. Even some things that weren't so pleasant. And that's why Sayaka, for the friends that meant so much to her, that's why she betrayed me. So when she said, She was lying to me from the very beginning. She was using me. You told you, my man. Told you, my koto. We shouldn't have uh, trusted her. But uh, well, in the end, she was the one that, that died. So, it's karma. Is that what she talked to me in the first place? Uh, I guess I never know. Because there's nothing I can do to ask her what she was thinking. Once you are dead, that's that. Boop, boop. Boy, how the trend the entertainment industry must sure be terrifying, huh? I mean, to try and kill someone just because of those relationships. Okay, dokey. She seems so nice and lovely on the outside, but inside, she descended into poor madness. What did you say? 
I understand. Really, I do. Jup, jup. You are in utter despair thanks to Sayaka's betrayal, right? Compassion, intimacy, love. The stronger those feelings, the stronger the despair when they collapse. Stop screwing with us. This is all your fault. Sayaka being forced to do something like that. All of it. Everything. It's all your fault. Suddenly, in a frenzy, I launch at Monokuma. But... That's enough. As angry as I was, Kyoko latched into my arm without hesitation. Her grip was like iron. Strong enough, I was sure it would leave a bruise. If you really want to make her enemies pay for what they have done, you need to let it go for now. Damn it! Doki doki! That was the close one. I thought for sure you were gonna give me a good whopping. Okay. Just barely avoid punishment, you did. Hey. Now then, since you so magnificently revealed the identity of the killer during the class trial, the black hen, Leon Kuwata, will receive his punishment. Oh, oh Punishment? So, so just, just I didn't have a choice. I had to kill her. So yeah, that's it. I was just protecting myself in the heat of the moment. It was self-defense. How exactly was it self-defense? Hmm. When you forced your way into the bathroom, did you or did you not use your very own toolkit? After she had she, she shut herself in the bathroom, you went out of your way to head back to your own room. You came all the way back and broke into the bathroom and killed her. Am I wrong? She had any number of chances to stop the Jordan. But you chose not to. Is it not because you had an uncaded intent to commit murder? No, that's not. Stop it. I have heard enough of this. Oh, are you sure? You were closer to her than anyone, were you not? He killed your precious Sayaka, do you understand? I can't say Leon is all alone to blame. Of course, I don't plan on blaming Sayaka either. Because... Because the one to blame is him. Huh? If it weren't for you, it was this, this never would have happened to Sayaka or Leon. We shouldn't be fighting each other. We should be fighting against the one who put us in this situation, the mastermind. Did you awaken to your sense of justice? I know Well, it just so happens that there's nothing more unethical than an unwavering sense of justice. After all, it's people with that sort of mentality that perpetrate war all over the world. Huh? Is that the kind of justice that's awakened within you? Just shut up. Let's hurry up and get to what everyone's been waiting for, the punishment! Uh, I'm begging you, please, don't do this! No more begging, no more excuses, you must pay the penalty for breaking the rules, society demands it! Stop, please! Punishment time. <laughs> okay, let's see what's going to happen. Ooh.
to our baseballs. And everyone's here to watch. <laughs> Tell some love. He did. But he deserved it. And Sayaka too. She is not saint. What we saw. That was the true face of the spirit. I mean, if we can call it that, what else could we call it? Man, my adrenaline is pumping right out of control. What's going on? I can't take this anymore. Do we really have to keep doing this? I just don't take it. Yeah. Well, hey, if you don't like it. Outside world and accept living here forever. But that's only if every single one of you can get on board with that. <laughs> fuck you. What the fuck are you doing all this evil shit to us? No, no. Have you? You make it sound like I'm some dark, awful secret society type of guy. Anya, Anya. Or in this case, a dark, awful secret society type of bear. Uh. Um, so, why aren't you putting an upstanding junk citizen like me through such a grueling ordeal? I know, me. It seems like you're trying to use common sense to make sense of something that doesn't make sense. That's like trying to put a mile on a scale. I just don't think it's possible. Uh, oh. uh, I don't think what you're saying and what I'm saying quite fit together. <laughs> you piece so of nice. shit. I don't know who you are, but I'm gonna pound your ass into the ground. <laughs> you must really hate me to get so angry, huh? But if you do that, you are barking way up to the wrong tree. <laughs> what happened happened because more than one of you decided you wanted to get out, right? No matter how much time passes, you can cut free to regret from the outside world. You are to blame. <laughs> Chris, you can cut free of the outside world. Being trapped in this insane place. <laughs> you are trapped, honey. Are you? Well. I'm sure once you learn all the mysteries of this school, your tiki will change for sure. You will think, boy, isn't it so wonderful how we all get to live here forever? What are you trying to say? No. I feel like there's some deeper meaning hidden in there. Just like before. Anyway, let's get to the black and Spanish man. That's what everyone's waiting for after all. No. Don't you say everyone? Who exactly are you referring to? Sorry, I said everything I got to say. I need to save some of the fun for later. <laughs> And just like that, he was gone. He, le he left us he there, ov overwhelmed by a nightmare turned reality. Even after he was gone, we stood there forever, unable to move.
Actually, no. It wasn't that long, I think. Everyone just lost their sense of time. We were all too scared. Scared of being alone. <laughs> oh, he's crying so much. No one even tried to speak. Your faces were stone, but your voice is dead. But it was in that moment. Makoto, can I talk to you for a second? She's moving close and whispering to my ear. Naegi kun. Before we head back, there's something I want to talk to you about. It's about Sayaka, isn't it? I'm surprised you figured it out. Yeah. I told you before the class trial started. You had to figure out the mystery of this case yourself. You want me to realize. Oh, sorry, <laughs> I'm running as if it was her. You want me to realize how Sayaka betrayed me by myself, didn't you? The talk never even crossed my mind. I feel like such a fool. Becoming such an easy target that, that, like that. So, Sayaka meant to double cross you. That's a fact that you can never change. But even till the very end, she wasn't sure of her decision. That's why, as she lay dying, she was thinking of you. She was thinking of me? You can just say something like that. I mean, there's no way you can know that. Only Sayaka will know for sure, and we can ask her now. Dakedo. Even if you can't ask her, you can infer it, don't you think? Her final thought was how she could protect you. What? Soreba. The fact that she used her last ounce of energy to leave her dying message proves it. If she didn't care what happened to you, she never would have left a message. That's true. Well, maybe she just well, maybe she just wanted to get back at the person who had killed her. That's funny. That's certainly one possibility. But I don't think that's what it was. Tonikaku. She was uncertain. She wasn't sure she could kill someone or deceive you. Which is why her plan failed. Her hesitation attracted failure. So? It's almost ironic when you think about it. Why are you telling me all this? Because you are the kind of person who can overcome this. Because you can move past the deaths of your friends, Sayaka and Leon, and keep moving forward. So? Without someone like that, the others will never be able to break free of such desperate situation. Move past her death? That's... I could never do that. No. I'm going to carry them with me th the rest of my life. How could I possibly ma move past something like that? Leon, Sayaka, I'll carry them with me forever. I'll carry their memories with me wherever I go. So, instead of forgetting them, you are choosing the hard world. <laughs> well, I have high expectations for you. As she said that, she revealed the smallest smile. No. By the way, I have to admit, I'm curious. How did you know I want to talk to you about Sayaka? Oh, well. I am psychic. Huh? Huh? Kidding. I just have pretty good intuition. Well, we survived. We lost three already. First chapter. Ooh, we got another spare bat. Yes, please. We are again in our room. Okay. Uh, I think I will leave it until here. It was quite chaotic, to be honest. Everything was moving so fast. And I hope I get used to all the... 
all the systems, all the, all the, you know what I mean. Uh, it was information, and information, and information, and information. So about many, how do you call this? all the, the mechanics of this game and the, this trial was way too much for me to understand I know this was the easiest one because fucking Sayaka wrote her, his name on the wall come on it wasn't even that hard to figure everything out so now I hope the mister or yeah the murder mysteries will be harder because this one was pretty easy to my liking. I mean, I did, I really did get excited when I was started uh, figuring everything out for my small brain. But I really do hope they, they start um, getting a little bit harder to resolve. But all the mechanics of the judgment took me really. They were too difficult. <laughs> at some, at some time, they were too difficult for me to understand. I mean, the bullets, I got it. Okay, I understood. I had to. I missed many times because of my aim at the words, or maybe my timing. Uh, I think I need to realize that I actually do have a lot of time to check on all the conversations that they have. I don't need to fire on the first on the first round of comments. That's a, a mistake I made. Um, but also the, uh, the last mini game, it was so difficult for me to understand. But once I kind of got the hang of it, you saw that it was quite quick. So I'm really ashamed that I that I lost I lose a couple of times at that minigame. Maybe I I didn't read it that well, maybe maybe I didn't really comprehend. Maybe I, I'm really stupid. Please have some pity on me. Just, you know I'm not a I'm not a native native English speaker. So you are by bi when you are bilingual more actually like bilingual you know but actually I speak three languages so <laughs> I'm polyglot oh god well I will leave it until here guys I hope you enjoyed it <laughs> it, it was it was fun it was fun I'm I'm still having a lot of hopes for this game I'm really curious of what's coming next, next. And if I have to choose a favorite character right now, that will be Celeste. I like her. <laughs> I mean, I'm also a, a Lolita, so I love her fashion style. Uh, the character I dislike the most right now will be Hifumi, totally. Come on, Kifumi, you are disgusting. <laughs> okay. And as I told you, we should have never trust Sayaka. I knew that. I knew Sayaka was not up to no good. But we are good people and we went and trust her anyway. But it backfired, so... That's karma, bitch. So, okay, I will leave it until here, guys. Thank you so much for joining me, and I hope to see you again in the next time. Bye!